Hi you guys, Lindsay here. Welcome back to my channel, Inside the Hem. So it's true, I am moving. It is kind of bittersweet because as you know, I've made some really great sewing friends here locally, but I am excited that I will be taking on a new adventure and meeting new sewing friends in Charlotte, North Carolina. Um, it's about 200 miles from where I live now. So not very far, like culturally or regionally or anything like that, but there are going to be some big differences, um, namely the weather. <laughs> um, I will officially have four seasons. Um, so all that I've been talking about not making winter coats is out the window and I will be incorporating making some coats in the future because I will probably have a chance to wear them. Um, so that's sort of exciting. Um, what else? I am going to be filming um, kind of, I guess it's like some tips for moving. I don't know. I haven't really flushed it out yet, but I will be recording the process of packing up my sewing room. Um, telling you guys how I plan on uh, organizing everything, transporting everything. Um, you saw the sewing room tour that I did a couple of weeks ago. So I will do um, another sewing room tour in my new space. It's really not that different of a space. Um, I will have a dedicated room again. Very, very grateful for that. Um, but a few things will be different. I've learned a lot in setting up this space and we'll make a few changes in the new space. Um, you guys know I have my feature wall over there with the spoon flower wallpaper. So I'm going to be doing a fun video on kind of the removal process of that, what it's like. The first video I did was just kind of first impressions and how easy it was to put up. So I'm going to kind of do that in reverse and let you know how easy it is to take down. Um, I know that you probably are wondering if I'm going to be able to reuse it. And unfortunately, I don't think that I'm going to be able to because the wall that it's on now is narrower and this wall has a door in it. And my new space, it's on a longer wall with no door. So I wouldn't have enough of it, I don't think. I'm trying to figure out some ways that I could use it. Um, so if I figure something out, I'll be sure to let you know. But I'm not even 100% sure how I would transport it. I don't know what happens when you stick it. Like, can you stick it to itself? Will it come apart? I don't know. All that is to be determined with the wallpaper. Um, I will kind of be sad to not have it, but I do have a really, really fun idea planned for the new space. One that anybody can do is very affordable and is also movable. So if I ever move again, I could just easily replicate it and not have to spend really any money at all to do that. Um, so I'll be showing you guys that as well. Um, we move in, gosh, probably a week, a week from the time that you're watching this. So it's happening really fast. I'm trying not to tear up while I'm talking about it, but you know, when I moved to Charleston, I didn't sew. I, um, had not found my passion for this craft yet. And so everything I know, everything I've learned about it, I've learned here. So, um, it'll be really weird to leave it. I don't know why I'm so emotional. Um, there's just, you know, a lot of, a lot of, um, what I've been able to do, uh, professionally has come because of all that Charleston has, has brought to me in terms of sewing and the friends I've made and stuff like that. So as you guys know, it's always bittersweet to like move on, but I really am excited about what is next and excited about, um, the journey ahead. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to keep you guys updated, let you know that you will definitely be seeing like a different background, be seeing some kind of like weird transitional times when the sewing room may not be put together perfectly. Um, but we will get there eventually, hopefully really quickly. Um, I'm kind of excited that I'm moving, um, like in the beginning of, December or like the early part of December so that um, come 
January 1st, the beginning of the year when resolutions are happening and you're thinking about new beginnings and you're thinking about clean slates and kind of like starting over every year, um, I will hopefully be fully settled in my new space come that time. So there won't be any chaos or drama. I'll be able to really settle in and be able to focus on 2019 and just, you know, make it an awesome year and awesome future for myself. So um, anyways, I just wanted to let you guys know that that was going to be going on. And um, yeah, I will see you all sometime very soon. I'm pre-recording videos, so they'll keep going up. You might see this space behind me for a little while longer, but not forever. So stay tuned for that. It's really exciting and I can't wait for y'all to see. Uh, until next time, I'll see you all very soon. Bye.